half wit. There was a man who worked at a refinery. He had a half witted son. The man stole some of the molasses. He put it into a gourd. He gave it to his son to sell. He said to him, sell it to somebody who doesn't talk. The boy took the gourd. He went, he asked the first person he met if he wanted to buy molasses. For how much he had asked him. Oh, I will not sell it to you, the boy answered. You talk. My father told me to sell it to somebody who does not talk. He went, he met another person. Buy molasses. For how much? Oh, I can't sell it to you. You talk. After this had happened with several persons, he went out into the country beyond where he, people lived. There he met a dog. Hey, sir, do you want to buy molasses? The dog did not speak. He said to him, buy molasses, buy molasses. The dog did not speak. You are he to whom my father wants me to sell the molasses. He poured the molasses on the ground. The dog began to lick it up. Now you've got the molasses. Tomorrow I'll come for the money. The boy went home. His father asked him if he had sold the molasses. Yes, father. I walked, walked, walked until I was tired. But finally I found a fellow who did not talk. I spoke to him three times. He did not answer. Tomorrow I'm going to get the money from him. Will you know him again if you see him? Yes, I'll know him. Good. That's the man I'll sell molasses to every day. Next day, the boy went to the same place, but the dog was gone. The spot was covered with ants and flies. The boy asked them, Where's that fellow to whom I sold the molasses? They did not answer. The boy got angry. He took a stick. He killed them. When the boy went home, he said to his father, The man to whom I sold the molasses was not there. Only ants and flies were there. When I asked them where the man was I sold molasses to, they did not answer. His father answered, You are a fool. To whom did you sell the molasses? Just then, a dog like the dog he sold the molasses to passed by the door. That dog looks like the fellow I sold the molasses to, said the boy. Then his father knew that he was crazy. He kept asking what he should do to him. His father said, To get rid of him, go collect the money from him. He ran after the dog that had passed by. He began to beat it. A man asked him, why are you beating that dog? Because I sold molasses to one like him and he didn't pay me. From that time on until today, the boy has beaten every dog and killed every fly that he has seen. One time he came to a king's house, he went in. The king asked him, what do you want? I have come to tell you that I have sold some molasses to a dog. And when I went for the money, he was not there. He had gone. Ants and flies were eating it all up. The king saw that he was crazy. To get rid of him, he said, Whenever you see a fly, kill it. At that moment, a fly alighted on the king's head. The boy smacked it. He knocked down the king. The guards rushed up to arrest the boy and take him to prison. The king said, Let him alone. He was only carrying out my orders. And the king kept him in the palace as an example of how a fool will often make of a wise man a fool.